Happy New Year Eve for all. I really hope that you will kind of <laughs> cope with one more Christmas theme layout. But I think this um, idea of the layout will go perfectly with any kind of uh, photos. I'm just using my Christmas photos because I really love them and I want to add them to my scrapbook album. Uh, I'm playing with December hip kits. This is from the main kit, one of the papers, and there's these lovely frames uh, behind um, in the back side of the paper, and I really want to use them. So I printed out really small uh, photos. They are like less than two inch for one side. So really small, but I don't care. I really like to add them. Um, this idea actually came from reading comic books, because <laughs> you can see there's like one photo and the second and blah blah blah. So I got the idea from there and in the, um, I think this was in Project Life Kit, these embellishments, lovely die cut ornaments and I want to add them too to this layout. The kind of um, look that the frames are also hanging from somewhere. Uh, so I'm just designing how I want to set them, but this is the idea. Lots of small photos with the frames. And I want to add something behind this, all these uh, photo and paper layers. So I decided to grab um, the color kit from December. There was this lovely stencil with snowflakes and lovely texture paste or shimmering paste from Shimmers. Um, I'm trying to catch all those small snowflakes without adding the whole area of the stencil with the texture paste. It's a bit tricky, but I will make it work. And once they are the snowflakes are completely dry, I can start to make the layers. Um, again, I'm using 3D foam for every, every layer um, and adding them just to the frames. Some frames are a bit too uh, big or small, but then I will cut the photos even smaller if they are too large. And for each photo frame thing, I will make small paper layer collage to the back to make lots of layers here. Um, and as these are really small, the photographs, I think I have lots of space to play with the embellishments and papers. And that's why I want to add all these paper pieces I have left from other layouts. And again, I'm using stapler. It's so quick and easy and it gives me, um, it makes able to add more layers between the paper layers because there's no glue or double-sided tape or anything like that. Um, I'm keeping for each five photos the similar kind of papers to make it match perfectly completely through the layout. Um, and from the main kit puffy stickers, exclusive for Hippie Club. I found the word wonderful, but obviously it's way too big to add on top of one photograph. So I added, there's uh, W and O, then N and D and A, blah blah blah. Um, you get the point. And it's not super visible, the wonderful word, but it's there. You can see it. And it's not the main thing. Of course, the photos are the main thing. For a couple of the photos, I'm also adding chipboard sticker frame um, and covering uh, it partly with embellishment one flower, but I think that's fun. It's so much fun to add kind of frames on top of photograph, especially in this kind of case when you can see the photograph completely still, even though there's the frame on top. Um, also, we have these lovely small wooden stars 
And I think they are going well for this layout as there's those snowflakes on the back background. And I know that I will color the background. Um, because otherwise these stars would be maybe too dark. But I will make it good. Um, I didn't use those ornaments as much as I decide, uh, designed it first. But I think it looks better right now. <laughs> um, but obviously that's in my head. So now I'm going to color all those snowflakes. The paste will resist the watercolor and mist what I'm using right now. Um, so the snowflakes will be visible, partly at least. Um, and I really like this technique. It, it's quick and I know I have been repeating this technique like in many of my videos, but I don't care. I li really like it and it's it's something that I want to do. Um, and as you see, the snowflakes are becoming much more visible and funnier and the stars will also be much better there. So, okay, I'm clapping my hands together here <laughs> like you would see that, okay, right now, yeah. Um, hopefully you are not listening to that anyway. So what I wanted to say that this layout might look really tricky and layered, but as you can see it's actually super simple. So I hope this inspires you and I hope you have a great New Year's Eve. Probably the most creative one what you have ever had. So have a nice new year. I hope we will have lots of fun together in 2019 and I want to thank you for this year. It's been a pleasure to make some videos and inspire you all and you have been inspiring me. So thank you for watching this and all of my videos and subscribing to my channel and I really hope we will see you again in next year with Hip Hit Club especially. So thank you and have a great new year.